Good morning, everyone. Happy Monday. How's everyone doing today? We are over here. Hendrickson Lake. It's a little overcast, a little foggy. But I love this kind of light because it gives amazing reflections in the water. And that's what life is all about. What we reflect, we get back. So this morning, it's Monday morning, and um, I'm going to put a little challenge out there because the whole world is, seems to be challenging everybody. Uh, <clears throat> hey, Kev, good morning. So um, I'm going to put a challenge out there for this week and, and going forward is um, do you represent what winning looks like? I keep hearing this term, uh, the saying, do you represent what winning looks like? Uh, everything you do in life should represent winning. Um, so every decision you make and every choice you make, you need to think to yourself and say, does this represent winning? Um, smoking weed all night not, doesn't represent winning. Getting drunk all night doesn't represent winning. Um, overeating and eating all kinds of junk, junk food doesn't represent winning. Um, complaining about stuff in life doesn't represent winning. Um, not doing your workouts and not getting out of bed and sleeping late and being a bum doesn't represent winning. Um, dressing like a slob doesn't represent winning. Um, whatever you do in life, make sure it represents winning because we set the tone in life. We set the tone for ourselves. We set the tone for those around us. Um, Listen to a little Victoria Osteen this morning and she talked about cheerleaders. In a football game, no matter if the team is winning or losing, the cheerleaders don't change their tone. They are always winning. They are always cheering to win. And no matter what happens in life, you need to keep your tone in a winning tone. No matter what's going on, no matter what's happening, we need to just keep winning, keep that winning tone because that's setting the tone for everyone around us. If our attitude is about winning, those around us will see that and their attitude will be about winning. And then we all win together. Uh, fire starts fire. I keep saying that um, you can't start a fire without fire and as uh, people around you are winning people around you are doing good people around you are succeeding it lights the fire in you to do the same Um, if we're sharing love and we're sharing good those around you can't help but be the same Um, so just think about that today and, and going forward it's Monday morning new week ahead of us new opportunities um everything you do needs to represent winning. You need to be the cheerleader. We need to keep cheering. No matter what's going on in our lives, in our family's lives, in our friends' lives, just keep cheering them on. Um, Because life's too short to uh, be miserable. Uh, Forget your excuses. We all make excuses. Um, Represent what winning looks like. Every decision you make today, tomorrow, and for the rest of the year, for the rest of your time on earth, ask yourself, "Is is this what winning looks like? And if you live like that, if you live in a winning mindset and you set the tone of a cheerleader where you're cheering for yourself, you're cheering for everyone in your life, you will represent winning. So that's the message for today. Um, Really simple. Just, you know, as I'm saying, what would Jesus do? What does winning look like? Same thing. Every decision you make, is it winning? All right, so let's jump in prayers here. We're going to keep these things moving. I don't want to get yelled at for making these things too long. So I'll give you a view of the lake here. All right, look at the reflections. All right, in the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death, amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. All right, let's get you back around here. All right, dear God, please uh, help all the people in my life represent what winning looks like. Have them keep faith in you and know what it is to do the right thing every day, all day, every day, right at dawn. Every morning we got to get up and keep on riding, keep on winning. Um, It's real easy to get depressed. It's real easy to... uh, to, um, fall back 
and, uh, and not be winning. And uh, it's a conscious choice we need to make every day. It's a mindset and it's a vibe and it's an it's a aura that we got to put out in the world. So that's my message today. It's Monday. Go win. Shout out to Mike Claudio because Mike Claudio's post this morning was about winning because that's all he does is win. So I tagged him on here. Um, I was also on a call last night with Anthony Hudson, another dude represents winning. Um, we've uh, crossed paths, we've talked a little bit, and uh, he also does live every day. And uh, just uh, great people in the world that represent what winning looks like. The more people I surround myself with that are winning, the more I want to win myself. So make it a point to, uh, to win. Be all about winning in life. All right, everyone, happy Monday. Go get some. God bless.